Hi everyone, today I'm taking a look at Orange Crush, the Journal of Art and Wrestling, Spring 2020, volume number one. So this is the first edition of this large print publication. I read about it in the latest issue of Pro Wrestling Illustrated, in the Before the Bell column, where it got four and a half out of five suplexes. I knew nothing about it prior to this, you know, I had some vague memory of seeing the cover. But when I read the review, I thought it was really fascinating. Because they talk about how this is the first time a publication is really trying to treat pro wrestling as the art form that it is. As you can see, it's very large. And it's very emblematic of Architectural Digest, The New Yorker. Basically a publication that features long-form uh, writing and design and photography and artwork and things like that. And it takes a look at gender in wrestling. There's multiple interviews, including one with Joey Janela here on the cover. Um, I believe there's at least three interviews or more. It's just really a meaty publication. And so let's crack it open to take a peek inside. As you can see, here is the table of contents. So this gives you an idea of who contributed to this issue what they're writing about. And yeah, I mean, we're talking about nearly a hundred pages of content here. A lot of great stuff. Taking a look at indie films, there's hand-drawn artwork inside, an article devoted to you know, gender and wrestling. It's on this heavy, Paper with a nice matte finish. The design is just fascinating. It just has, you know, it's definitely not a kayfabe publication. They're, they're looking at the gritty realism of wrestling and there's this amazing artwork inside, as you can see here. They hold nothing back. Here's the interview with Joey Janela, which spans multiple pages, where he dives into a whole bunch of topics, including his documentary and much more. I love the layout of this piece. I mean, this is just so cool. It's crazy stuff. This piece is about a community arts center in East LA. Take a look at this. Really great stuff. Yeah, so it's 96 pages of content here. Here's a sneak peek at some of the other things. Here's another one of those interviews I was talking about. Just amazing stuff. You know, in the digital age where we're used to reading on our iPads or phones and things like that, it's kind of nice to just have a nice oversized print publication like this. To just really dig into and take a look at what's inside. And there's plenty here. I mean, uh, many of these pieces are lengthy. You know, it's definitely something you're going to want to spend a lot of time with. Really cool. I do think that, you know, pro wrestling doesn't get the respect it deserves when it comes to it being an art form, right? I mean, people think of it as entertainment. Sure, it is. But when two wrestlers can get into the ring, or more, and tell a story, and just, you know, sweep us away with you know, just the tremendous talent that they have, and just take our emotions on a roller coaster ride, and really help us suspend that disbelief, I mean, there's nothing else like it. So here are all the people who contributed. You can see that 
Adam Abdallah is the publisher and editor-in-chief. And here are the other folks who were involved as well and contributors. Once again, let's just take a look at that table of contents so you can see everything contained inside. So you might be wondering, well, how much is this? Well, it retails for $25. So that is, you know, some serious chunk of change. But what you're getting here is a hefty print publication that's very high quality. You can see compared to my iPad Air 2, it's very large. You know, feels great, high quality, printed on heavy stock paper uh, with a nice matte finish. Um, it's just really just a wonderful thing and it's filling a void that we didn't even know we needed to fill right a, a journal of art and wrestling i mean how cool is that so yeah it's definitely not a puff piece by a wrestling promotion it's not a kayfabe publication it's the first time honestly that a publication is taking a serious look at professional wrestling as an art form and Hopefully this will be the first of many issues to come. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed getting that sneak peek at what's inside of Orange Crush. And uh, I hope you go and pick it up, because it's definitely something we need more of. So thank you for tuning in. I appreciate it. Be well, stay safe, and I'll be talking to you soon. Take care.